With some sweet tunes with instruments like the saxophone and trombone, a musical group is bringing back memories from the big band era. They're called the Crew Big Band, and they've been, they've been delighting Central Florida now for decades. And New 69's Carolina Cardona joined them for a session and tells us how that music from decades ago lives on. One, two, three. They're the Crew Big Band. We have five saxophones, four trumpets, four trombones, and a full rhythm section plus two vocalists. Don Lohr is the group's founder. But prior to founding the Crew Big Band, he was co-founder of the Altamont Jazz Ensemble for 33 years. Lohr then went on to join the VFW Post 2093 Community Band and in 2008 formed the Big Crew Band with help from Wilbur Smith, the band's director. Don and I have put a lot of blood, sweat and tears, especially Don, and you know, because he's been the librarian and he gets the music out. He spends endless, endless hours about putting the, the books together. A lot of areas where we play, uh, they want to hear that, that, that memory from that period. Both men wanted to preserve the legacy from an era when ballrooms were filled with the sounds from the saxophone, the drums, trumpets, and trombones. At that time, bands were very popular. The big bands were still on tour. Uh, Tommy Dorsey, Harry James, and Benny Goodman, they, they came around to our town. The big people that played, Cad Anderson, uh, Harry James, uh, the people that played with Basie and all that, it was, you know, the people were just so phenomenal. Uh, and it was, you know, they were role models for us to get behind and, and perform uh, like them. A style of music that hasn't faded away, even after almost 80 years, when it dominated the radio waves and social gatherings. <laughs> The 84-year-old began playing the trombone when he was in fifth grade in Allentown, Pennsylvania. That's where he also met one of the members of the group, Tom Solman. We were both in the senior class together, and here we are in Orlando, Florida, and have linked up again after many years. It's at the VFW Post 2093 in Orlando where they sharpen their tunes every Monday night. Oh, giving local players a place to share their love for big band music like Chaz Zito. I've been wanting to do this all my life, singing with a big band. When Don contacted me, we kind of, by mistake, found each other. I came to the rehearsal and he says, yeah, you want to sing? So I started to break into singing with them. Some of those songs include a favorite by the artist known as Old Blue Eyes, Frank Sinatra. Fly me to the moon. And a popular Italian melody. It's just so much fun to go out with them. It's just a, a labor of love and it's a labor of, uh, the music is just, it's wonderful to be able to be a part of it. Carolina Cardona, News 6 at 9. Make sure I like to go it. out. Yes, we need we need our gowns on to go out for that. And they play at events and charity mm -hmm. events. And you can find a full list of, or if you can listen to some of their songs on our website. Yes, and they're available for bookings too if you want to throw your own big band party. <laughs> Maybe for Why a wedding or something. Mm -hmm. Why not? That is so great. And I love how a lot of them are just kind of embracing, you know, the, the old decades. Because I feel like big band, little by little, mm -hmm. is starting to kind of die away. But you have like a Michael Buble and things like mm -hmm. that are trying mm -hmm. to make it mainstream again. I like so. the swing music too, you know, oh, a little yeah. bit more like upbeat. A little more yeah. upbeat, yeah. yeah. It's awesome.